Hello everyone and welcome back. Um, in today's video, we are going to be doing a Seven Deadly Sins video. I know where Seven Deadly Sins been. Um, so I've, I've basically bit, just been grinding um, a, just a little bit. Um, so I've got some pretty good characters up there now. I mean, this this dude, what's his name? Evan is actually pretty good. Like he, I think he has evasion on this card if you rank it up to silver. Yep. For one turn, and then um, I think the yeah, it just increases the stats by an extra fifty percent for the gold. But yeah, so this dude is really good, and especially if you put that buff card, like if you use it and then use a your ultimate, then it will just like completely wipe out whoever you're uh, wanting to get out. But as you saw there, his ult is level five, like five out of six. So that is that is pretty good. Um, who's next? So we got we got Escanor. Um, with his ultimate move, I recently got him to level two. I recently got a version of him. Um, so I don't really use this Escanor much because I am um, running mono red, which is the team I'm going to be doing today in the video. Um, and I'll show you how far that's got me in PvP. But that that has been absolutely game changing. So. It's been really, really good. But this dude, again, affinity level 5. Uh, his equipment is non-existent at the moment. Because <laughs> I've put it on um, someone else, but he did have pretty good equipment on. Um, and the unique's always useful. Um, you know, removing buffs and debuffs. The buffs isn't so useful, but the debuffs is really, really useful. Especially if you're um, in, like, JP. In the JP meta, obviously... Um, Red Meliodas counters this dude like really easily, but um, if there's like if you come up against Elizabeth, then you can just like merge your cards and then um, you can get rid of the stun. So yeah, there's that. But the one I wanted to showcase today is this dude. This Red Escanor is an absolute beast. Oh my god! So the amplifier damage <laughs> is insane, especially when you get to the gold. With um, a golden Arthur, Arthur buff, after I can't speak Arthur buff. There you go. Um, and obviously, I'm going to be doing ungeared PVP, so the damage won't be as high as usual. But I've had like 170,000 damage um, when when I'm um, doing some PVE content because obviously there's geared allowed in that. So yeah, that's really good. Um, and there's also the uh, drain on the silver card, the uh, charge and fire, and then on the gold, obviously it defeats three alt gauge, which is really really awesome. So he's just he's a he's a tank first of all, with loads of damage and really good utility as well. So he's really really good character, and obviously it's Escanor, so the ultimate just like smacks really hard <laughs> against anyone. Um, so yeah, that's really good. Um, See. Yeah, so these are the characters I'm not too fond of. I mean, I could level up Blue Merlin, I suppose, for the um, Ultimate Association, but I don't really see the need to. I got her recently, the Green Derriere. She's not great, her damage isn't brilliant, but um, again, with Arthur, if you get the, um, the Royal Sword, the buff card, um, even if it's just like a bronze, that ultimate is just clapping anyone. <laughs> like, anyone you come up against is just completely gone. So, um, yeah, so that, those are the top characters for me at the moment. Um, obviously Arthur's one of them. But the gear, on my Red Escanor, for where I'm at, is pretty good. I think that's, that's pretty good gear there. Um, I could put... Yeah, I need to get him... Get him? Get the rune, um, like plus five as well, and then I need to get this one up to like five stars, plus five. So yeah, his gear's pretty good. So um, if I was to do gear PVP, he'd be slapping real hard. But the problem is, um, with all these pierce teams and stuff, the rest of my characters don't have like great gear. Like I'll show you the gear on Gotha, for example, uh, the equipment. Yeah, see, so it's, it's, I've really been focusing on Red Escanor, but 
when I get the mono red team like fully geared and stuff, and I and I get them like five star um, plus five all the gear, then uh, it should be really good. But anyway, that's enough of that. So that's that's my roster so far. So let's get started with some PvP. Let's go into the ungeared. Right. So this is what I've got with the um, with the mono red team here. I've got a house in the back, he's not that useful in Ungeared um, Unless you've got like uh, Lilia, Blue Lilia For the pierce rate increase But he's just there for the stats increase So um, that's pretty useful But this team has got me all the way up to Master 5 Which is absolutely insane um, Considering I think before I was on like Gold 5 And I've gone all the way up to Master So that's awesome um, but the problem is now, in Master, there's loads of Blue Melee and Blue Lilia um, Pierce teams and stuff like that, and there's loads of different hybrid teams. So it's quite difficult to successfully win, so hopefully in this video we can get some wins, at least. I hope so. But yeah, so um, this team's been helping me a lot. Obviously I'm not like the best mono red team player out there. Um, I'm not 100% sure of the plays to use sometimes. Obviously if you if you get the chance to rush gold, um, the gold buff card, buff card like this, then definitely take it. Even if um, Green Eskinor's there, because he, he can nullify the buffs, but on the off chance that he doesn't do that, Red Eskinor completely like collapse in like, yeah there you go. So that, that green Eskinor's gone. Oh I just spotted that red derriere. Okay. Invasion Aro Jama uh, Could be a problem. Hmm I think What am I gonna do? After Zolt? That makes sense. Uh, do that, and then let's just chuck this off. How much damage is this? Oh! 52,000! You see what I mean? <laughs> oh my god, Red Derriere is just gone. That's insane. That is absolutely... That's mad, isn't it? Like, I just took out Red Derriere, so she wasn't a threat at all. Obviously, obviously I've got the uh, debuff in the team. Ooh, this could be a problem. Right, who to take out? Gotha's not killing anyone. And I'm not really rushing any ultimates, so I think I'm going to go for the... Yeah, I'm going to go for the... Escanor. And then nuke into Gotha. Yeah. Let's give that a shot. So Eskinor should be dead, especially if I get a crit. And I do. So there we go, 70k, nice. Bronze card. 31k. That's not bad. Mind you, they, they do have Gil Thunder, so I think he has like... He increases the defense. On all of the characters or something, but he he's um... Definitely mitigating some damage here. Right, so I've still got on me, so shouldn't kill. Oh, how low is Gotha? Is he like really low on health? Alright. Um, what do I want to do here? Merge. Buff card. This should get Gotha down. Hopefully. Oh my. Really? Really? That close? Right, well at least he can't sort of regenerate too much, so I should have to play to win next turn. So let's do this, yeah yeah, I've won. GG. And then Golden. I can't remember what that's called. What's it called? Move card. It is light pillar. Right, there we go. Light pillar. Lightning. 
Wouldn't you forfeit by now? No? Okay. Like, it's not just me. If there was, like, just Gilfander left, I, I would forfeit, like, immediately. But there we go. So that, that was the first match won. I mean, I think his team was basically um, riding on the fact that Red Derriere would be able to get to her ultimate and then just wipe anyone out. Or um, uh, Green Escanor would have been able to get to his ultimate. But um, obviously, I got rid of both of them pretty quickly, so there wasn't a chance for the other team to be a threat. But um, they could have played that differently. They, they possibly could have won that one. But we'll see. Is this a green Escanor or a red Escanor? I have a feeling it's red. Oh no, it's not. Ooh, what do I do here? Ooh, I've got an idea. Okay. So let's attack disable. And recovery disabled. Nice, so that limits their turn a lot. It's also allowed me to get a golden um, royal sword, which is awesome. Um, now they're not attack disabled next turn, which is a problem. Nice. Not bad. That's, uh, yeah, that's really all he could do. Right, so what what should I do? Just, yeah, go for the gold? Yeah. I mean, I have, um... Yeah, they have no way of stopping my, um... Gopher's ultimate. So he's just gonna, like, drain them all. Straight away. And then I've... I think I've got the winning play next turn. Because if I get rid of... Oh, are they going to try and nuke him down? Hey! Oh, that is really clever. Okay, so they've got their... Oh. Tricky. <laughs> oh no, maybe not. Yeah, I can just drain and then... Golden Light Killer. Chosion <laughs> Nice. And then recovery disable. Oh, that did a lot of damage. Right, so I think Gotha might be dead next turn. Oh, hopefully Gotha's not. Oh no, they've got a gold. Escanor guard. Yeah. Rethinking the play. Okay. Again. There's that. Okay, come on, we need an, another charge and fire card, otherwise... Yeah! Okay, cool. Uh, what do I want to do here? Okay, do that. Make sure he's dead. Because <laughs> I think he's a real threat. But he's gone. Nice, so this goes on someone else. Nice, I was hoping it would go on Escanor. Then... This is what I'm saying, this dude just like, nukes anyone down. And then he can drain as well. Right, so is he gonna? What's he gonna do? Okay, rush off. Really? I think he's given up at this point. Yeah, I would have given up at this point. Right, so is the Escanor up there? Well then, Perfect. I mean, this definitely kills, <laughs> so, yeah. Wow. And then this kills uh, Escanor, and then there's just Green Merlin, was it? Green Merlin left? <laughs> yep, GG, good game. Uh, there's nothing to do with it. Yeah, I really don't think there's anything... Yeah, even if they use the ultimate. Which they can't do. They won't be able to do that next round. Providing... Yeah, she'll still have at least one silver card, so I can rank down the skill and ult drain. Oh, wow. Okay, okay forget that. 
<laughs> Forget it. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm really sorry. Tokusti you see what I mean? <laughs> but, but when I inevitably come up against like a um, too many injury I'm probably going to lose on that one because I've lost every single match up against them. Actually, no, bar one. I've won one of them. I've won, I've won one of those matchups, but I was incredibly lucky. Like uh, it was a massive fluke. Oh, okay. We're having network issues. Internet problems. Okay. What's going on? I swear this happens in every video. <laughs> I have like one internet connection problem. Right. Really? Red Merlin. Oh, okay. That explains it. Do you think it's possible? I doubt it. Yeah, I'm gonna uh, disable that. I could have gone for the same play of like attack disable and recovery disable. I probably should have done that actually. Yeah, that was a bad play on my part. But I can definitely do it this turn. And I think I get Gotha's ultimate as well. Unless he gets it his first. There's no way, right? Right. Okay, so they haven't... Oh, no. Yeah, that's a problem. Okay. So they might freeze Gotho. After this play. Because, yeah, I get Gotho's ultimate. And I... And attack the same. two times. Nice. So that limits their play by a little bit. Unfortunately, I'm definitely going to be... Um, frozen, right? I mean, I'd assume I would be frozen, right? Yeah, that's that's one million percent of freeze. That's got to be a freeze, right? Huh. Yeah, there we go. So I go to frozen. Huh. Arthur's frozen. <laughs> oh my huh. god! I was gonna say they don't have a full freeze, do they? Yeah, there we go. Did they forfeit? It didn't even come up. They must have lost connection or something. What? It didn't. Even, it didn't even turn up. They were just like, nah. Oh, they probably rage quit. Yeah, that's probably it. They're like, fuck these teams. Mono red. We don't need them. Get rid of them. Red Escanor. Ah. Oh, I don't know. Okay, that's definitely green, right? Green Espinal. Yeah. Okay, so the original team. Ooh. Should I? No, no, no. I'll tell you what. This seems to be the play to go for. Attack disable and recovery disable when there's King on the team. Because that will get rid of a lot of their potential plays. Come on, upgrade. Oh no, I can still get... And I get got... Oh, okay, that's really good. Yeah, so I can still get the Royal Sword buff. And Arthur's ultimate in the process. You see what I mean? There's not really a bad play for this team. Yeah, you may petrify. Oh, you petrified the wrong people. I was gonna say, if you petrify um, Arthur, I'm done. Yeah, about that. <laughs> he got so lucky though, he had like two petrifies. Unless you're running a Kingdom team, I've not seen that. Like, anywhere. Right, so what are they going to do now? Rush Eskinor's ultimate? Really? 
Or they just... <laughs> wow, God just taking beating. Right. I think... I'm gonna do that just in case. And then attack the Esquinor. Yeah, let's go for the Esquinor. Just in case this doesn't kill. Um, I'm going to be disabled so we can't hear that. That was so close! So close though! Okay. Well, <laughs> GG. Yeah. Wow. So as soon as you get the golden royal sword, that's it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That is, that is just game over. You're done. I mean, you could try and come back from it, but there's pretty much no way. Oh no, that's blue, maybe. Interesting. Not doing much in the cool. but I suppose so. I suppose that'll work. In some matchups. Oh, that's really tempting. But I think this is the play to go for. Just so we don't have any sort of retaliation play. Okay. Definitely don't offer it. I think they were trying to burst down Arthur, even though he's still got the gold buff active. Right, so what I'm gonna do. Trust me, guys, this will work. I'm gonna get rid of the. Because after I get rid of him, there's no threat. Perfect cue. Hmm. Yeah, I think the guy emotes it before that. Yeah. Oh, nice. That's the team gone. That's it. GG. Nice. I was gonna read out the name, but you can't really read that out. They're in the um, ultimate attacker guild though. Guild? I've been playing too much Marvel Realm of Champions. Um, what's going on? Hello? Game? Thank you. Please don't save your life. So I think the. Oh, maybe. With a one on one, Eskimo should take out. Oh, that was close. Right, I'm definitely buffing up Eskimo. Just in case. But, uh, yeah, there's no way. Yeah, there, there is absolutely no way to get back from this. Yeah. You're done. Well then. Ooh, one more fight. One more, go on. <laughs> we'll do one more. This is the last fight, so... Ooh, no. 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 Nice, there we go. Almost, I've done that before and then they out-CC'd me and it was like a Pierce team. I just lost straight away because I forgot to activate the um, CC food. That's the food I'm running with this team, by the way. That's why you see 107k. Ooh. Okay. Interesting. <laughs> they have no play to beat this. They can't remove buffs. They can't do enough damage, they can't petrify. That play is a godsend, oh my god. You just like, as soon as you get that, you're like, I've won the game. <laughs> I've just beaten the whole game. Wow, okay, so I'm gonna get down King, I think. Mind you, he's not really the problem. What's your 
Yeah, I don't think the king's the problem. It's either Gotha or Lilia. I'll tell you what, I'll go for Gotha. And then... Merge on my Gotha. Tokoshite agemashi. So that goes and there you go, two red Escanor cards, just gone. Just like, what can they do? Right. Oh, I can double recovery disable next turn, and attack disable. Oh no, they're going to be old. Not to Escanor though, he's just tanking it, he's like, yeah, whatever. Right. Hmm. What do I wanna do? Merge on Arthur? Okay, let's do that. Here. Thinking of all the plays that could get me. Uh, yeah. Okay, that was wasted. They didn't really need that heal. I think the place of Rush Eskinor's ultimate. I think so. I mean. One of them's just gonna heal up anyway. I think that's a golden pill they've got. Oh, this is tricky. Like, right. So I've got the buff. So hopefully, King's ultimate doesn't crit. Okay, please don't crit. Please don't crit. Please don't crit. None of the ultimates crit. I have one. Well, I'll say it. Yeah, merge that straight away, that's good. Go for an awful day. Oh my god! Hey! Oh my god. There you go! Should we just play this out? Oh my god, I just got wrecked. In ungeared, that would be the best play ever, but and sorry, in geared PvP, but this is ungeared. Right, well if I can click the button, there we go. Okay, so that's how you beat a red Escanor team. Just get super lucky with all of the um, cards. Oh my god. They had like a gold petrify and double roll. What were the chances? Okay, I'm a bit salty after that. But like four out of five matches I won. So that just shows like even like the ratio of the matches you win to the matches you don't with the mono red team. It's just like you win most of them, like 90% I'd say, you'd, you'd win most of the uh, fights, unless you're against um, blue pierce teams. But yeah, so if you like this video, smash that like button, um, and subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye!